Hey guys, this is Bonnie. I'm coming to you as I prepare for round three. Um, the doctor that I'm choosing, I think it, I might go with Cabral because I feel like that. I love, I want my waist snatched. I seen another doll and her waist was snatched and I loved it. So that's what's making me go back to Cabral. Um, other than that, I've been looking at other surgeons before I booked my um, appointment and everything, but I know for a fact I'm going with them. So I'll probably just like send a $50 to book my appointment tomorrow. Um, I'm coming to y'all to talk to y'all. And I know I, for a fact that I said that I wasn't going back to Cabrera. But I changed my mind because I know for a fact the results that I want, he's going to give me. So I'm going to go with him. So don't be mad at me, dolls. I'm just saying. I want to go. This is my last surgery. My finally my last surgery. If I do get anything else, it's going to be like little minor enhancements like Botox or stuff like that. But other than that, this is my last round. My final, my last round. If I do get another surgery, you guys better get on me. Like, I'm serious. All my doll friends better come at me start, like seriously because this is my last. I'm tired of healing. I'm tired of aching. I've been aching since my first surgery. And I'm tired of taking my body through the changes. And, like, even, like, I just be aching. So, um, I'm going to see you guys and tell you guys who I shoes because I didn't tell nobody who I shoes. Probably like a couple of dollars I told them who I would choose. But I'm telling you guys who I choose to do my next surgery for my round three. I'm going to pray on it, pray for myself, and make sure that I'm straight. Because can nobody save me or help me but God. So, I don't want no negative comments. Um, you can like and subscribe to my channel. You can also follow me on Essex underscore body on Instagram. And yeah, X is Bonnie on Instagram, or I think it's at SX Bonnie on Facebook. So I came to you guys to talk to you about surgery. You can ask me any question you want. Any doubts that know me, that know me on Instagram, they can ask me any question that they want. More than more night, if I see it in my inbox, I'm definitely going to answer. I'm definitely going to talk to you guys. Um, I'm gonna tell you the reason why I pick a bro. Well, I think I told you already because I know for a fact he can snatch my waist even more. I want my waist a little bit smaller, so like. You know, that's the the main reason why. But also my butt. I'm gonna show you guys to show it to you guys. But also my butt. Um, I feel like they can have more projection at the bottom. Like I went for um my last surgery was for my breast. I'm going back to get them done again. My last surgery was for my breast, and I had got bottom booty in the house. I got like under my legs to give me that cup because I don't know if you dials know me or if you do dials follow me on. Um, Instagram, you will see that I had no butt. I had nothing. Like, I was just flat. So, I never had a cup. So, for me never having a cup, I have to get a cup made. So, either, like, that's the thing. Like, I'm scared because Cabrillo's not known for his cuff, but I heard he was getting better in his boobs. He's not known for his cuff, but the waist, he's known for snatching it. So, I'd rather snatch my waist even more than have a cuff because my butt is already huge and whatever. But I'm just worried about like mostly my waist area and my boobs also. So last time I went to Cabrera, he, he was supposed to give me a breast lift and he didn't. He gave me boobs. I mean um, implants. So I got implants, I, which I requested to have implants. He was supposed to give me a breast lift. He didn't. I already had one prior to in, any of my journeys. That was my first surgery that I had where I had my breast done. I had a um, reduction in the lip where it was no implants. But I felt like it was so pretty and I loved it. Until after they start setting, settling and sagging. So when they start settling and sagging, I feel like, okay, well, I need to get, you know, implants to enhance them. But I was feeling like that I need a sky revision when I went and got them. And he, I told, I expressed this to him and he didn't do it. So I woke up with boobs and they were fine. Like, they're fine, but I just, I want them, at this point, I want, um, sky revision. And I want a breast lift when I get them because I want them to set up. I don't want... I don't have to wear a bra, but I, I wear one just because I want that look. So I don't really have to wear one, but I just want that look. So I wear one to push them up. So that's what I'm going for this time. I want to push them up. And I want them a size bigger also. Um, I will tell you guys all the surgeries that I had. I have had, um, my first surgery was, like I said, a breast lift and a reduction. My boobs was big. Well, they wasn't big as what I thought it was, but they were big to me. So after I got the breast lift and reduction, I started feeling depressed because after my boobs started sitting, they feel like they started getting flat and saggy. So I said, I'm going to go get implants with another lift to, you know, enhance them. He didn't give me a lift. He just gave me implants. So they enhance and they feel good. Like, I, I can go without getting it, but I just want to, like, I want to just get myself together. 
Um, my after that first surgery, I had got my second surgery was um, arm lipo, tummy tuck, and a BBL. Um, my third surgery was I had lipo between my legs. I had lipo under my chin. I had lipo behind my legs. Um, I had lipo more lipo my waist area. Um, and I had him put the fat into the bottom of my butt, which um, I would not ever convince the lady to get lipo under their butt to try to make a cuff because it hurts so bad. Um, my third surgery, I went, ooh, my third, ooh, first surgery, today's second surgery was the BBL. Third surgery, that was my third surgery. My third surgery, I had got what I just told you guys. So my fourth surgery, I know it sounds too much. I know it sounds like too much. When well, my very first one I got in Georgia and I didn't like the results, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna go out of the country. So this time for my fourth surgery, I wanna get my breasts a little bit bigger and I wanna get a lift so they can sit up. They don't even really have to be bigger. I just wanna lift and sit them up more and I want my waist up them more and I want my behind a little bit bigger at the bottom so I can get that fullness. Cause I have the drop, let me turn around and show you now. I wasn't gonna show you to the end, but I'm gonna show you now. I have the drop at the top but I don't have the cuff that I want in the back. But like, I feel like that, if I have this right here and the cuff to smooth it all out, it, it'll give me that. Cause I'm gonna turn around and show you guys. Cause if like, if from the side look good, from different angles look good, but in the back, it just look wide and flat, I guess. So I just want a cuff to cuff it, cuff it up a little bit. Um, and I think that'd be perfect. Um, what else do I want to talk to you guys about? I definitely want you guys to comment below so that I can comment back to you guys and I can talk to you guys about whatever you need. Or a lot of guys already know that I'm personal, so you can inbox me. And if that's not enough, I will give you my phone number so we can talk about it. Um, this time when I go to surgery, I'm if my son is out of school because my son is in college, um, I'm definitely going to bring him with me so we can do it because he has his own blog channel. So he's gonna vlog it for me going our way through from the airport all the way here. Better than what I do, because everybody knows that I show everything that I can show, but I really wanna show everything. This time I wanna show my surgery and my procedure. I'm gonna talk to Cabral about that. I've talked to him about it before, he had no problem with it. So I'm gonna talk to him about it again so he can show my whole procedure. But I want my son to come so he can like do my videos, edit my videos so he can show the whole walk through the airport situation and everything else, like going all the way through from the surgery, from me sitting in the waiting area to like everything, like uh, recovery house, um, just everything, so that you guys have a better insight about the situation. Yes, I'm in my bathroom. I'm in my bathroom because I've ever had good lighting. I have a ring light, but the light is not giving me a lot of light. It make my face look kind of ashy. So you know, and I, I, I just don't want the ashy look. So I'm just coming to you guys to talk to you. And if you guys ask me more questions, I can answer you better. Um, I did, however. Um, if you follow my page on Instagram, you'll know that I was burnt. I was burnt recently. My my first surgery right where I was burnt. The second surgery right where I was burnt, and I have like two burn marks on my stomach. This is from the second surgery, and this one is from the first surgery. I will be getting them covered up soon with butterflies or something of the sort, and getting them covered up. But that's not gonna scourge me or stop me. I'm just gonna take better precautions. And with those, I didn't stop smoking soon enough. So. They say uh, nicotine cuts the oxygen level off, whatever. So I'm gonna stop smoking two months prior because I'm at the point where I'm just ready to go, but I'm waiting to get my son his situation, his situation with school situated so he can come. Cause I was gonna go to Miami to uh, Mia Co Cosmetics or Mia or whatever, but I was hearing a lot of stuff about him and I, I wanted to take a chance cause he do really good boobs, but like he did, he he wasn't. I feel like wasn't gonna give me. The waist that I need, cause like everybody know in the states, they don't take a lot of fat. I want my waist to be snatched, and I feel like my waist is pretty good now. And if I get one more round, my waist to be snatched, and I'll be straight with that, cause it's pretty good now. My waist is good. Let me say, did you guys see the flattage, the flat situation right here? I want that to be filled in this time, so I don't want no more at the top, cause like I right hear it's fine, but I want it like at the bottom. I don't know if you can see it or not, but I want that at the bottom and I want the flat part filled out like so it can be nice and round. I feel like I would have the perfect butt if he filled the bottom of it and it'd be nice and round. Uh, what else do I need to talk to you guys about? Um, I'm going to be preparing for my surgery. I'm going to be vlogging that. Um, I shared on a, I had a previous video 
that I share with my supplies and I lost the information to that page, so I researed it back on this page. Um, I'm going to do some, getting the supplies that because I have a lot of supplies already, so I'm going to be getting other supplies that I need. I'm going to be showing you guys the process of that. I'm going to be showing you guys the process of me going to my doctor here to get my hemo and everything that I need to get fixed or well, not fixed, sorry, but checked out and make sure those is fine before I go. Um, I'm also with, my, with that, I'm going to start two, three, two to three weeks in advance. Because I want to get, I'm going to get one, and when that come back perfect, I'm going to get the second one, that come back perfect, the third one, and that third one is going to be my yes, okay, and go ahead. I'm going to make sure I'm taking my vitamins, I'm going to take you guys through that process. Um, I'm going to take you guys through the whole process with me this time, because I feel like uh, with my little skits and videos that I was giving wasn't enough, so I needed a whole vlog of it to show you guys, like, truly the whole process. I want to show you guys when I wake up, I want to show you, I want to show you guys everything. So that you know, because like when I was coming up and trying to get into the service community, nobody was helping me. Nobody was being there for me. So I want to be there for you guys. I want to show you guys what you need. I want to, you know, I want to help you guys. Because some people get surgery and they say they didn't have it. Some people get surgery and be secretive. Some people get surgery and just act like they don't know nobody in the surgery community. They, when they first start, they ask them 50 million questions. And then when it's time for another dial, and they still creeping on the pages and their vets, well, not solely all of them is vets, but they probably have one, one surgery or whatever, maybe two but when other people ask them questions or ask them if they have surgery, they want to lie and say they didn't or whatever the case may be, I'm not that dial, I'm not that person, dials that know me know that, like I said, you can call me contact me, I don't like about myself, I don't even on my personal Facebook, they know a big change, because I was really big and for me to wake up the next day with a flat stomach, I was like, okay I just cried, I like to die so I know for a fact when I wake up this time, this body is going to be, like it's snatched now, but it's going to be snatched on another, another level. So I'm looking forward to that and waking up, of course, but I'm looking forward to that and I'm just ready for it to be over with. Um, everybody, you know, I don't know everybody. I think I posted on my page, I have a grandbaby on the way. So my thing is that with my grandbaby on the way, I want to get my surgery before it's the time for her to be able to come so I can heal before she's here. Because I'm definitely going to love on her. I have one child and this is his first baby. So he's spoiled to death. So I'm definitely going to over spoil my grandbaby. So, um, I don't know if that's too pleasant or whatever. But at the end of the day, I'm definitely going to let you guys follow me. So, um, subscribe to my page. Like my page. Give me a thumbs up. Like my page and subscribe to it. Um, and we're going to take this journey together. Like always, I'm going to make sure everybody is included in my journey. Um, I don't understand. I don't know if, I, if it's any base that I haven't covered. If I haven't talked about anything or anything enough or help you guys with anything, just ask me for comments in below. Or follow me on Instagram, um, SX Bonnie, SX underscore Bonnie. And you can ask me questions. But you definitely have to like and subscribe to my video. And I'll have your back 100%. Even if you don't, I still will. But I would I would prefer that you like and subscribe to it. Because this is where I'm going to be doing all my stuff at. On my YouTube. I give enough to Instagram. But now I feel like I should just switch over to a different platform. And this is where I'm choosing to come to. So again, this is Bonnie. Like and subscribe. And ask me any question you want. And I will answer it. You guys have a wonderful day. And thank you for watching me. Bye-bye.